All right, flight socks. Flight, flight, flight. Okay, so this um, instantly getting hit with this pop up. Uh, that's cool. Uh, exclusive is very, um, very uh, bold. <laughs> Catches my attention, but it doesn't. It doesn't tell me what the what the code is. So I don't know if you've tested this and you found that not telling them what percentage or what like ten dollars off, whatever it is, is is better um i usually find the inverse um unless you're offering like five percent off then i guess not um but that's just my uh that's my gut reaction all right comfort never looked so good was that an r8 or something what is that why did it stop that's gonna keep going um seductively <laughs> ridiculously comfortable <laughs> Uh, okay, that's a bit much. So I'm trying to, like, right away seeing this, I'm wondering who your demographic is. Um, I guess it's, like, what, like, uh, early, like, like, like millennials, like, 20s, early 30s, um, just getting into the corporate world, looking for some, some awesome socks. Okay, free shipping, U.S. order Canada. Okay, that's cool. I don't actually love this font. Um, it's very, it, like, it's spaced out. The letter, the letter spacing is is big, but it's like it's not bold enough. Um, it's like a condensed font. It's not. I don't know. Uh, it just feels off. That's my, that's that's my gut reaction. So take it as you will. Trend Hunter. I feel like I've heard of this before. Ooh. So this is one image on mobile. It might look a little sketchy. Um, okay. So this is good. I obviously, have some uh, have some. Um, Press coverage uh, to build trust. Shop styles. Okay, read more. Okay, shop on Instagram. Flight socks. What's going on, on the Insta? Taking forever. Everything's taking forever to load because I'm uploading videos simultaneously, so it's just it's just a mess. Um, okay, lookbook. Let's check that out. It's kind of nice to see your site load insanely slow because then you know like what the problems are. Uh, so that's like a benefit. So it looks like you guys did a lot of photo shoots, which is cool. I hate when people have like one um, one product. Uh, sorry, one one model with the product and like different shots, but like the same clothes, same everything. It's just it's so annoying. But at least you have a couple people. Um, yeah, and he looks is that the same guy. I think it's yeah. So we're good. We kind of spaced them out. Okay, cool. So that's just a lookbook. Okay, and I can space them out. It'd be nice to see like a description or whatever, a quick link to buy them, but I guess it's not necessary since your product, um, your product selection is low right now. But you know, for the future, it's like the shoppable Instagram thing. Um, I don't like this menu. It like confuses me. Why half the stuff are over here, half of them is over here. I'd either keep it um, center aligned and keep. You know, two things here, two things there, or just you know, move the logo over to the left. I'm guessing that you kept the logo centered because the logo itself is very centered. Um, I don't know what that logo is. Um, first reaction: a guy fishing out of a bowl with a little tiny jewelry inside of the fish bowl. Um, oh, there it is. It is actually a pig carried by a goose. Okay. So. So there's that. Um, I think you could do a better job on this page. Uh, I think this is a Shopify, right? Uh, I think you could do a better job on this page because this is where you really like tell the story about your company. I'm sure that you guys have great personalities because you run a crazy sock company. Um, so I think this would be you know the difference where, uh, or <laughs> the part where you tell people what sets you aside. Um, Right, our Kickstarter campaign doing thousands of socks. Sweet. Um, changing the game. So, I 
uh, you're obviously running analytics. Yeah, it's a Shopify, so I thought. Um, you're obviously running analytics. Um, so I don't know how much value there is in this page. It's a great page. This is a great concept of having, you know, an image like this. Um, I just might put this um, inside of, I guess, our story or just about us and then, and then have part of the section be, you know, you as a company and, uh, and, you know, how cool you are. And then the second part being how awesome the product that you is that you developed. So I think that would be helpful just to get rid of that page because I don't I don't like this drop down um, I also don't know why these are all uppercase and these are not kind of inconsistent um, I guess it's just too much gray for my eyes okay FAQs where you ship to shipping okay standard stuff uh, there might be a better presentation for this sort of FAQ maybe with, with a little plus signs not necessarily um, you know toggleable however you want to say it, so they open up drawers uh, but just having them uh, more more separated between between the headings and the subheadings because they visually get kind of lost. Um, okay, so now to the store. Oh, that looks cool. Okay, okay, great image there. You've got okay. <laughs> well, no. This is kind of weird to see a person with only one shoe on and they're like professional. Mm, I'm not, I don't know how I feel about that. So, uh, I don't know if you're doing mouse tracking, screen recording. I don't know if people do this, but like this is kind of cool. I, I, I would do this. Um, we'll hover over all of them and see them change. But what's the deal with this, um, with this one shoe guy? The majority are made from fiber. I I don't understand. Okay. Care instructions. That's not the same sock. Oh, and this is okay. So this is part of, you know. Yeah, I would. Mm, changing the game that section. I would. I would still probably consolidate with the about us page, and then. Make this image smaller. It takes up to just the entire screen so you can get related items so you can get that upsell going. Because I don't think you need two of these. Or maybe put this image at the top of the page like on the other one. Like here. Um, or just get rid of it. I, th I think it's just a little, a little too busy. Um, well, this one's sold out. <clears throat> Caught my eye too. No wonder it's sold out. Yeah, you got some uh, shots of them in action. This image needs to be a little more saturated and brightened up. Um, okay, cool. So, so I think you guys are, are nearly there. Um, I would just shop now, change the game. Does that only take you to that page? Yeah. On Instagram. I would also, um, I, I don't know how effective this section of the website has been for getting uh, email signups. I'm sure you understand the value of email signups, but um, I just wanted to emphasize that it would be it, this the bottom right above the footer is a strong is a strong place to put you know a primary call to action, probably to shop now or. Uh, yeah, actually, probably to shop now. Um, so, I think if you're not getting significant signups through this banner, drop it in the footer, and then here use the space to have a strong call to action to shop now, or like view all styles. You know, it doesn't have to be a, a hard sell like shop now. Like you know, like I'm not ready to buy. I don't even know what this is, but you know, like view view all styles, shop styles. You know, just just view them. It's, it's the same page, but you're just viewing them. Checking out what's available, um, and then obviously you know use remarketing and um, cart abandonment um, tactics to get that user back if if they bounce. Um, so I hope that's been helpful. Um, if you have more designs or if you need help with something, uh, feel free to reach out on Facebook or you can contact me directly. Um, it's Alex at VenmarkStudio.com. Um, so um, good luck with your business and. Um, Send me a pair of socks. <laughs> All right, cheers.